Hey everyone, this is Kevin T. Rodriguez, film critic of iCritic.net, and uh, the following video is actually made for the Autograph Hound channel. It's not the full video, it's just going to be part of the video, but I kind of figured you guys would really like to see it, so I'm going to just put it forward, and we will close out at the end of this. Hey everyone, this is Kevin, your Autograph Hound, and I am doing a special video on location today. We don't normally do location videos, but I figured this would be an interesting one. We are actually and a signing for voice actor Vic Mignogna. Now this is at um, Awesome Collectibles in Bell, California. And I kind of figured I'd you know, make this video to show you what some of these meet and greets kind of look like. I don't know if we're gonna actually get Vic to be guest starring in the video to today. That might be too much. But here's how it's working. Right now, from what I understand, the they are charging money for the signatures. They are charging $30 for a signature. 50 if you want a photo as well. I know not everyone can afford to do that. Now, some people might ask, what is the point of these signatures, these autograph sessions when they charge money? Because I know some people come to these things and they expect it to be free. Because, you know, you're buying the merchandise, you're doing all that stuff, but here's the thing. Especially when it comes to like voice actors and things like that, they're not actually making much royalties from the merchandise. They make their money at conventions, at meet and greets, and they make it for charging for autographs. So, that's why it's working the way it does. Now, someone says, well, what do I get out of the $30? Or sometimes it's 20. Well, here's what you get. You get your item signed, which in this case, I bought a few things, I wasn't sure what would be allowed to be signed. Now, since they're charging for money, I'm just gonna get one thing signed, and that's gonna be the Broly Steelbook Blu-ray. That's what I'm gonna get signed. Um, obviously because he's the main character in that one, and it's the limited edition Steelbook, so it's unique. And, you know, oh, there we go. Got a lot of people around here. So, you know, that's what I'm choosing. And you also get to support the artists. I mean, keep in mind, especially when it comes to like anime voice acting, anime voice actors don't make that much money. They, they really don't, don't. I mean, they, they definitely make a comfortable living, but their bread and butter is conventions and appearances and things like that. And then you get to meet them. And if the photo, or in this case, maybe, uh, the video is that important to you, then you know, maybe, maybe, you know, it would be a nice little experience. I mean, the one thing you do have to keep in mind is sometimes these people, and I'm not saying this is anything like Vic, from all accounts, Vic is a very nice guy, I guess we will find out. Sometimes the voice actors, because these are paid events, you know, they, they're they not always the most personal, sometimes they are, but we're gonna, gonna give you like a little rundown of what this looks like. So. So this is the line to get into awesome collectibles. As you can see, it's pretty long. Now, one thing that you haven't seen is how slow this moves. I'm kind of moving an inch every couple minutes. So this might take a good hour. Now that suggests that Vic, who is inside, is probably very personal, probably talking with his fans, because if the signer is not personal, then typically the line goes by pretty fast, and it's, you know, that. That, so this is actually a good sign that they might actually spend some time with us. So anyway, standing in line is just one of the things, and it should be noted, this event started at 11 a.m. It's now about two and it runs till three. So I can only imagine what it was like when it opened. There, the line was probably a heck of a lot longer, but eh, you know, I had things I had to do in the morning, so we're here a little later. But you know, there are still people in line and Hey, you know what, you can see the entrance at least. Um, I've been to some signings where the line's around the block and you're just waiting for hours. So I don't know if you could have heard all of that, but that was Vic Mignogna. He came out just to basically thank us all for being here and that he'll get to us shortly and hey, you know, that's something I've actually never seen. I've never seen someone actually get up in the middle of the signing and come and say hi. So, yeah, this is probably gonna be a fun experience. So one of the interesting things about lines for autograph sessions is you never know who you're actually gonna run into. And I ran into Bob Miller and he's offered this book, The Anime Voice, Interview with Voice Actors, and you actually interviewed the guy we're going to meet. That's right, I interviewed um, the whole cast of Dragon Ball Super. Super, okay. And so they talk about how they, you know, they talk about their craft, how they do it, advice for people who want to become voice actors. This book, Animated Voice Volume 2, will tell 
uh, people who wanted to be a voice actors where it's all about. Oh, neat, neat. And so, so who else aside from Vic has been interviewed in that book? Well, I've got Christopher Sabat, Sean Shamel, um, Monica, Monica Leo. Oh, uh, I'm you know? sure, sure people watching this video will love that. And then, and, uh, then I have a section on what's called pre-lay um, voiceover. That means the animators animate to the voice of the actor. So I've got the classics like I've got Mel Blanc, June Ferre, and uh, Lucille Bliss. Ooh. Ooh, I might have to... How much is that book? I might have to buy one. Well, it's um, $17. Okay. It's available on Amazon.com. Is it available on Barnes & Noble by any chance? No, afraid not. But Volumes 1 and 2 are now on Amazon.com. Volume 1 has interviews with Pete Docter from Pixar. Oh, I've met Pete Doctor. He's a nice guy. He's a very nice guy. Actually, Pete's in this book, too. When he's Oh, neat. Because um, he was helping out with the dub of Howl's Moving Castle. Right. So I've got him mentioned in this book as well. Oh, neat. Yeah. Awesome. Well, anyway, folks, one last time. This is The Animated Voice, Volume 1 and 2, available on Amazon.com. Amazon Amazon one of the unintended side effects of being in a line this long in a collector shop is if you let your wife into the shop, she ends up buying things. BB-8. BB-8. Woohoo! I don't want to hear a thing about paying for this autograph. <laughs> okay. And we're almost there. Almost. Almost. We almost made it. <laughs> I'm so glad you guys are here. Thank you for being here. I'm not going to lie. That Simba figurine is terrifying. I mean, I'm looking at the Scar one and the Simba, it's like, they don't look that different. They both look evil. What were they thinking on that one? Although I will say, that one's awfully cute. Right, so, so, thank you, and here he is. The here he is. is. Yes, and I'm here too. I came to see him. He did. I've been waiting Mo all day. You guys don't even know. Yeah. I've been in line all day, yeah. just waiting to meet him. Yeah. Well, well, one of your helpers was happy to meet me. No, 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 he's your helper. Oh, that is true. That is true. So, hey, quick question for the viewers of the autographs. Yes. How they like collecting autographs? What's What's the best way they can ask for an autograph? Well, you know what? Can I just say something? Come a little closer. I want to tell you something. I've never really understood, like, buying autographs online. Because, to me, the autograph is just a signature on a piece of paper. What the autograph signifies is the moment that you got to meet somebody. Mm -hmm. So, like, he's going to take away a signature, but it's going to remind him of this moment when we got to talk and meet each other. The signature by itself doesn't mean much, but it's a memento. It's something that you get to take with you to remind you of the time when you met somebody whose work you enjoyed. So if you're interested in an autograph, I hope you'll come somewhere that I'm in person so I get to meet you in person. It makes it much better. I like you that. Agree? Yes, I agree. And this was Straight a... from the autograph hound. Yes, right there. Exa exactly. Thank you. So that's the end of the video. You know the drill. Hey, could you say the like, favorite, and subscribe? Oh, like, favorite, and su subscribe. Yes, yeah? you have to say that every time at the end of the video. Like, favorite, and subscribe. So thank you. And just to let you guys know, we got this signed. <laughs> Limited edition steel book. Sweet. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you so much. <laughs> And welcome back. And as mentioned before, the full video will be released on the Autograph Hound channel below. The link is below, so you can subscribe to that channel. But hopefully you enjoyed that. And I'd like to know, were any of you there? Did you ever get to meet Vic Mignogna? What were your thoughts about him? I'd love to know. Comment below. Like, share, subscribe. And as always, flame responsibly. Have a good one.